Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new video. Today we are going to be playing Fortnite again. Um, before I uh, start the video, um, basically, I have two skins I'm, or three skins I'm always probably going to be using. Number one, the Shadow Enforcer. I'm always going to be using it. It's like, it's little, oh, it's like an icon skin. Let me find it too. Kit Bash. Kit Bash is all around a really great skin. And it reminds me of Five Nights at Freddy's. So that's why I'm going to be using it because I'm a FNAF fan. Let me find it. And, um, wait. Number three. Frost Breaker. Frost Breaker is just a really good skin. Probably not going to use it as much. But it's probably going to... I don't know. But it's also just going to be like one of my skins. So just want to get that off. Uh, let's play. I'm gonna show you guys um my progress in my map, and I'm probably going to be building some more to that map because it's still not done. But finally, it came out way faster than my other one. Um, guys, did you guys just see uh a couple weeks ago? Did y'all see the new FNAF plush trailer? Whenever the full game comes out, I'm just going to be making that whole map. I don't care, I'm, I'm, cause I'm already debating making that map, cause we really did get a lot to see in that trailer, but not enough. Hey guys, um, hashtag um, Martin Luther King. He's a really great guy. Uh, if you have Fortnite, you, you should play his map. Oh yeah, here's this map I want to show you. This is a different map. Okay, I think it. I think it should be time to leave now. If you, it's a. If you know, you know. Oh yeah. By the way, this is like one of the best creative maps ever, in my opinion. Except I want to go back to the classic creative map. It just looked more cool. Basically, I changed the name to FNAF Roleplay. The reason why it's called FNAF Roleplay is because. Whenever I like finish it, finish it, I hope to get like some YouTubers to do like a big YouTube RP and probably some of my friends too because I don't know, because I don't still know if I'm going to do the Roblox FNAF movie, but if I do do the YouTube one or the Fortnite one, I'm probably going to make it be the, the, um, the what's it called one. Oh yeah, basically, here's my map. A couple, or, let me finish with last. I'm probably going to make it be the, um, uh, what's it called? The, um, SFM one, the, uh, Zapper 70, or Zappin 770. But anyways, uh, back to the map. This is my map. So I actually, um, added the Sky Dome. I did, but now I low-key actually cannot find it. I, it's not even low-key, it's high-key. Because it needs to be, like, way darker. I need it to be real. Like, the moment I turn it off, it's going to be dark. I need to make it not so dark, though. Ten. Yeah, guys, um... If, if does someone know how to, like... Like, find the Sky Dome... I don't know why I even added. I think I okay, but basically, uh, here it is. Why isn't it? Oh yeah, I added, I accidentally added two. There's another sky dome over here. I don't know why I added two sky domes. That was kind of dumb. But I'm basically, I'm gonna probably show. I'm gonna show you guys what I've been working on and kind of work on some new things. So basically, this is FNAF. Uh, wait, let me find it. 
This is FNAF SL. No, I'm kidding. FNAF SL's over here. It's I made it Circus Babies Rentals with a truck. So basically, it's gonna start off as um, what's it? you're in this truck. By the way, I know a tree just broke. The reason why there are like trees here and there's like a, a cave behind it is to give it the fact that like it's supposed to be abandoned. It was really high tech for its time. Even one of those places that had like a screen for it. But yeah, basically it got abandoned. So within making this map, I decided to use the villain base. But, I'm, but, I'm, but basically, you... But before it was gonna start off over here. This is probably gonna be how you escape. By this will be like an elevator. I don't know. Well, I, I like to t sometimes do things a different way. But I'm basically, I guess I'll show you the map. So instead of it being like an elevator, wait, how weird of me? I gotta show you Circus Baby's uh, rentals. It's pretty ba uh, bare right now. But I'm probably just gonna like add some stuff in here. Then going over here, you, as you can see, you gotta walk down the stairs because I don't know how to add an elevator. I know that sucks, but I'm only, but I don't really want to do a tutorial for it. So basically, down here, I've been adding some stuff to make it look more SL, S, make it look more super, S. FNAF SL. I should put. I'm gonna copy and paste this and add this to one of my maps. Cause I actually kind of like this. I don't think. Oh, no, I've never noticed this. Alright, guys. Um, I'm probably gonna add this to my FNAF 3 map. Or something. Remember, this Ziba is gonna be SL. I had a lot of pre SLs, but they never came through. Not FNAF. I'm gonna add it to FNAF 1. Because it has more monitor or cameras on the desk. But, guys, basically, today I will also be playing solos. I have so this is where this oh i know that's a different sky to, or that's a light source smh moments well now i gotta do that If you guys ever want to build like a FNAF map, you guys really should do it. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys. I'm going. I'm probably. I'm going to be showing you guys my other map. You may be asking, what is my the the TPRR map? I want to do like a little bit of like every update video, but only but just like a little bit. Because the TPR map, it's pretty good, but not too insane. Or insane! By the way, guys, um, I'm gonna get my phone fixed soon. So whenever I get my phone fixed, I'll be doing a gameplay of it. Because my laptop that I did it on the first time, it's really acting up. Well, it's been acting up, which is why I haven't done any Roblox games recently. But coming down back down here, as you guys can see, I'm probably... I'm might gonna do. I'm probably gonna show you guys the TPRR map and do some live up and do some um updates and different maps I have. And don't forget, I'm going to be doing solos. Like this map match, I'm probably going to be doing some solos. And maybe I'll do MLK. But I'm not really, I don't know. I don't want to make this video too long, but the last video, Fortnite video was 59, 
minutes. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm, all I know is I'm guaranteed to do solos. Okay, is my mic on? I don't know if you guys can hear me or not. I don't know. I'll have to check the recording or redo the whole video. Anyway, so now RTTP or Return to the Pizzeria. Now, guys, I remade this a couple weeks or like a month ago, I believe. No, I finished it like a month ago, I think. It was either like J June or July. But um, basically, should I redo the map? Cause I'm kind, cause I'm not as satisfied as I wish I was, as I should be. Because there's a lot of stuff that I just don't want to be here. I just shouldn't be here. And there's a lot of stuff I really want to make that should be my my other FNAF map. Basically, what I mean when I say that is Exhibit One, Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Now there's nothing wrong with this one. But, it's not as close to the, um, one in the g actual game. I want, so if I, so if I redo the map, which I probably am gonna do, redo. I, I'm probably just, yeah, I should re, yeah, I'm gonna redo the map. But, that is the first part, number two. When I made this, I, I okay. So whenever I make, here's a little pro tip for you guys. Or, or here's a little tip for creative. The reason why I can do like that is it's a specific setting. So if you do not know how to do that, you go to your phone settings. It says building has a prop. You can turn that to origin edge or origin center. Basically, it's most likely not. Right, let me see. Now, if you turn it to um original cent, it goes like that. So if you turn it, but. Basically, the goal is you turn it off, or you turn it off. So then it makes it like that. So that is a, so basically, that that's how I did it. But basically, within timing of, within the time I made this map, I didn't know how to do that. So basically, that, I did stuff like this, because I didn't know how to do the origin scent. It now looks really lazy. And guys, I'm, if if I should redo the map, comment below. Because I really want to redo the map a lot. Because I've got a lot better at creative. And I really want to redo the map. Because whenever I made this... Okay, so basically. Whenever I made this, I didn't delete everything completely from the other map I made. Like, yeah, that should be obvious, but I wasted up too much space. Like, a lot too much space. And I, I really just, yeah, I'm gonna redo the map. If you guys, if this, if you comment, if someone comments some, yeah, no, I'm just gonna redo the map. Since this is the old version, I guess I'll do a new version. But let me show you guys the, the second part. There's probably gonna be like a big chance I'm gonna play this on Twitch. Ugh. Okay, so basically, yeah, I'm redoing this. It's not exactly game accurate. I'm a lot better at creative now and I wanna make it so like you're actually on the bus. But anyways, basically, you walk around. Let me just do the first speed run part. This is probably gonna be like a big chance I put. All right, guys, next Fortnite video, I'm playing this all today. So I'm part. So tomorrow, on August 27th, I will be. No, you know what? No, I'm doing it tonight. I'm playing the full map tonight. Cause ever since a couple days ago, I now I'm obsessed with YouTube making YouTube videos. Probably because I watched like a lot of YouTube videos. Oh yeah, a couple days or last night I went back on a childhood train. 
I watched a lot of old YouTubers I used to watch that I really don't watch anymore. Okay, so basically, the map didn't go as planned. This room was supposed to have a zombie in it that would chase you, but in one of my old recordings, it chase like it's supposed to just like chase you, and then after like a couple and after so and so forth blocks, it dies. But what happened that I didn't want to happen is number one that the zombie would go off the map and keep trying to kill you and that is a threat it is oh wait, i forgot to get it it is tprr accurate but it's okay i'm redoing i'm redoing this map. but it is tprr accurate as you can see i'm redoing the map but it's not fully accurate but it's close to what does happen and there's also a zombie here all right guys this map really isn't that much two p or two player if you just want to know i played it on stream yesterday but not yesterday like a, like a weeks ago but this game is more one player I use I get a lot of anxiety from playing this game. I don't know why though. It's really not that bad. Oh, okay. This is probably gonna be like the last level I do. Before I literally spontaneously combust. I'm making my heart meter back up. Okay, the, I'm not scared of the map. It's just how, like, in the original TPR map, you're in a sewer doing parkour, the spring trap. It takes, it takes about a reasonable time to do it. But in my map, it takes like a couple, it takes like, like at the highest five minutes to do it. So if I redo the map, it's going to be spot on accurate. You know, before I probably, Okay, I'm probably gonna, what's it called? I'm most likely going to be, um, what's it called? I'm, mo I'm probably going to redo the map, but it's going to be so accurate to the game. But before I do it, I'm probably going to do a gameplay. Because whenever I made this map, I made it a bit, I made it really broken. Like, like stupidly broken. Like a lot of times the door doesn't work. I don't I should have added like two to that. But yeah. You cannot you really cannot get in this fint. Which really was a bad idea on my part. But before I spontaneously combust, I'm going to be playing some solos. Because I haven't done solos on the channel since like, a cu I, since um, March 6th, I think like March. Yeah, since like March. So it's been a really long time. guys you guys should play a lot more creative because the reason why is because it's really fun maybe it's just me but in minecraft i built a lot of the maps a little basic but a lot of times it would just be home or like spooky scary maps Ugh. high fly week hmm. that's cool My life be like, mm. you know, this item top is kind of garbage. Like, I really just like the Morty skin. I don't know if I like the Ferrari skins. 
I, you know what? There, I, I like just like three skins in the item shop. Guys, Fortnite Save the World isn't actually that bad. I before I, I used to think it w it really wasn't that good, and I could see why people really weren't playing it. But after Cypher played, I kind of want to play uh, Save the World. What black bling is that? What black bling is that? That black bling is kind of fire. Why does everyone choose that superhero skin? I really hope I do win this. But basically, okay. Um, okay, so. Um, last night, I watched a lot of, uh, I watched a lot of classic YouTubers I watched, or a YouTuber I, did, I don't watch anymore. He, he did some Roblox videos, his sister did it. He t some of them he played with his dad. If you know the YouTuber, I don't really like him anymore. Yeah, he's grown up. It's like Steven Universe. It was a lot better when he was young. No! I don't really watch him really now. I like his old videos more. Maybe it's just me with Roblox, but here, let's have a little chat for a second. Classic, do you know how bad classic Roblox, is, or how good classic Roblox is? Classic Roblox is, in some cases, in my opinion, better than Fortnite. And okay, boy, where are we going? Okay, but basically, I think a lot of times classic Roblox is a lot better than games like Fortnite and Minecraft. Mainly because of the Minecraft community. A lot of the Minecraft community is Dream Sands. And you know, they get offended when you don't wear a mask. Even though you're British and you don't have to. Now I'm not a channel that really con uh, covers Minecraft drama. I'm a channel that just covers game, most of the time gaming. And some gaming vlogs. If you check on my videos, I used to do Gotcha Life videos, but they're, um, they're gone. Just like Carl me costing much for all those No! You know, what? what is the point of this Fortnite light, uh, lighthouse? It's kind of boring. Okay, guys, pro trip. If you win at the shark a lot, there is guaranteed to be, like, there is usually around two chests over here. Dude, the shark has literally been pretty forgotten ever since, like, season six. Because people had to do the, the, um, Jonesy challenges. Thanks, Fortnite, for bringing back a Bell location. Oh, who's very real? Who's real? real? I know a lot of my friends I don't know. I know, cool dude. Sorry that I sounded weird, but I had to, but I just yawned. I really shouldn't be apologizing though. You know, that's a thing with a lot of Minecraft YouTubers. They apologize. They don't have a backbone. I don't mean like, like small Minecraft YouTubers like I used to be. Whenever I did Minecraft. Wait. I don't think I did Minecraft on this channel. Oh yeah, I did it on my last channel.